Hey Tribe Factory Squad, look what just arrived. I've been wanting to get my hands on one of the, one of the premium smart trainers and finally I've got it today. Now we have discussed this in earlier videos how India faces logistical nightmares when it comes to cycling parts and importing various accessories for cycling and trainers and various other apparels and shoes and whatnot. So nonetheless, finally it's here, Wahoo Kicker Core. Wahoo Kicker Core uh, is an elite trainer uh, from the house of uh, Wahoo. It's a trainer meant for all types of triathletes and uh, ultra cyclists. So if you've been wanting to see a review from an Indian perspective, from the perspective of brand new triathletes, here is the video. Keep watching till the end of the video and I'm going to be sharing some amazing footage right from unboxing to what comes in the box. Subscribe to my channel Drive Fandry, click the bell icon and I will keep bringing you amazing uh, product reviews on Drive Fandry Labs. Subscribe now. Here we go, we're gonna cut the box open. That's the other box, that is the outer box, how it was shipped to me. Now, the box is pretty heavy. The trainer itself is about 15 kilos. So pretty sh standard. Okay. Got it. Taking the contents out of the main box. Wahoo Kicker Core Box. Okay, what do we have here? Some foam rolling, foam pack packaging. Okay. This is the connector cable. We have the power cable. We have two different types of uh, power cables. This is the adapter, guys. This is some extra cable again. That's pretty good actually. Good on you, Wahoo, uh, for providing so many different types of cables to keep in mind the different uh, requirements by, uh, for the electrical output. We have a quick release in the box. We have uh, standard tools and some extra nuts and bolts for you to have it set up. There's a user manual right here. We should always, I always recommend that you go through it very quickly because you know what happens is we all are uh, discoverers we are all we all think that we already know about the components but it's always good to you know quickly glance through the instruction manuals so that you don't miss out or you don't misplace any components okay i'll come back to the other nuts and bolts for you now coming back coming to the main product the wow kicker board Guys, this is quite heavy, okay? So, better use both of your hands to get it going. Okay, the unit itself is damn heavy. Some heavy lifting for you guys. This is the main unit, guys. Now, Wahoo badge right there for you. Uh, we have to fix up the other leg of it, but uh, let me just show you the main unit. In the leg guys, we need to plug this in. This is, there are two legs to support the trainer right here. And I'm gonna be plugging it in for you guys and then we'll have a go. Okay, the weaker core does not come with a uh, cassette within the box. Uh, what I did was, I got my dealer to install a cassette for me uh, so that it comes preloaded. Uh, otherwise, what you can do is, basis the group set that you have, you can go for a 911, 1011, whatever, 811 uh, group set, uh, cassette that you like for your uh, bike. Get it installed. You'll need a couple of tools to have it set, set it up. Uh, I got it set up from my own dealer. But get a cassette for yourself, brand new cassette. This is a Shimano cassette which I bought myself. Stick around, subscribe to the channel, you should try Fantry and I will set it up and show you how it works. Hey guys, so 
just to showcase uh, how it looks like i have set up the trainer now i have uh, removed the rear wheel and i have set it up as you can see wahoo kicker core is all ready to roll i have also made an account on zwift now there is a 30 days uh, th free subscription on zwift so i've set it up i am just gonna try it out let's see how it goes so remember guys this is just an unboxing video and i will do a in-depth analysis and uh, tell you about how i felt about it and uh, any issues that i faced around it here we go squad this is the very very first ride that i'm doing uh, on the wow kicker core so i'm sharing my first hand review the first ever time that i'm riding it out uh feels great so far of course i can't comment uh, with a few pedals so uh, yeah I, I wanted to share a couple of things uh, which i learned from my own experiences that number one you have to install the wahoo app on your android phone or the ios phone when you do that uh, you will do the first time calibration when you're doing that uh, make sure you installing the ant radio and plus radio application on your phone so that there is easy connectivity secondly when you're setting it up make sure the location of your phone is on when you're setting it up trying to sync it for the first time you'll be able to catch it that's important uh, number two is that if you have a garmin heart rate monitor hrm try which i have it is not it does not sync with uh, zwift so you will have to order a uh, and plus dongle usb dongle for yourself for establishing connection so that's uh, point number 2 so these are a couple of points which i faced in my unboxing and setting it up for the very first time uh this is a this is a top of the line product of course and i will share further details with you the product reviews and how it uh, matches up with some other trainers in the same range i hope you enjoyed the unboxing video subscribe to try fantry and i will keep bringing you amazing training related stuff at try fantry labs i will uh, you should check out the playlist try fantry chronicles that's all about ultra fitness through global superstars who have been achieving amazing things in their lives that's got to motivate you guys keep training keep happy training to you guys train in your conquer hey guys if you enjoyed this video subscribe to my channel try fantry click on the bell icon and i will see you in the next video train in your conquer